Yo guys, it's Ta and welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you some cool tricks with this little bad boy, the Fidget Spinner. Let's get started. So, Fidget Spinners, you hold it between two fingers and spin it. With either a flick of one finger or like two fingers. That way it doesn't go as fast. Um, this one's kind of loud. Now, these have been banned in most schools. Um, you can take the caps off like this. Which I'm not going to do right now. Um, so. But after spinning it for just a little bit, just hitting it with one hand or two fingers gets a little boring. I'm bored. So, I'm going to show you how to do some cool tricks with your fidget spinner. First up, balancing it. You want to get it spinning really fast. What you, you'll notice on your fidget spinner, one cap sticks out a little more than the other. Make sure that cap is facing, is on your is pointer finger, and then make sure the cap that's not as out is on your thumb. That's very important. And spin it, then lift your pointer finger. It will balance on your thumb. If you don't move your hand, even if you do, like this, see, it's wobbling if I move my hand, but it's not falling. Well, now it's threatening to fall, but it didn't. So, but look, if I do it with the, the bigger cap on my thumb, it falls. So, that's why I said that that step was pretty important. Another trick is you spin it and throw it and try to catch it in the middle. This trick is hard. I gotta get a good spin. Come on. That's good enough. I got it. In the middle. Oh, I caught it like that. It doesn't count. Ugh. Oh, I caught on. I got caught one finger on that, and then two fingers on the bearing. So on one of the ah bearings. The trick is so hard. Oh, and then there's a trick to kind of make it fly like a helicopter. Go up, take your spinner, throw, and make sure it's going like a frisbee kind of. Then you just throw it, and sometimes it flies. If I, especially if I take out the weights from mine, because not all fidget spinners have removable weights, but mine does, so I'm taking out the weights right now. The weights are kind of like the bearings, but you don't want to take out the middle one, or else it will not ever spin until you put it back in. And on some fidget spinners, no, the weights don't come out on all fidget spinners, and also the caps don't always come off on all spinners, and the middle bearing doesn't always come out on all spinners. So, please keep that in mind. And please note, these tricks are pretty hard. So now, now I'll make it fly like a helicopter. It needs a little more weight because I took out the weights, but see? So yeah. Now, if you put it, this trick only works when it's like super like, compressed air, but I'm going to put it next to my fan. It's on full blast and see if it manages to spin. It spins pretty fast when you do that. If you take out the weights, I'm putting it next to my fan. It's spinning. Okay, I'll turn down the fan a little bit. Okay, guys can actually hear the spinner. This is the noise the spinner makes when it's not in fit. And it's make sure it is. That, so that's another cool trick. And yeah, so I'm gonna put the weights back in my spinner now. Those are just a few fidget spinner tricks. I'll do some more later, but I don't feel like cramming them all into one video. And also the other tricks that I was going to show, I haven't really mastered. Like, I had them, and then, um, like, I tried to make another. Like, um, I knew I'd fail on camera. And, like, if I did try one of them, like, the one way you make it, like, um, there are a few other tricks, but they don't. Like, well, you can make it balance on your pinky. I know I'd fail that one. I've always, I've gotten that one before, but... You see, it, it, it fell a lot of time, because I'm normally good at that, but uh, of course now I'm on video and I failed, so peace out.